Fires have been breaking out across Russia in cases of suspected sabotage. Dozens of army enlistment offices, railways and police cars have been torched in violent protest at Vladimir Putin's invasion of Ukraine. Video footage of one incident, shared on Telegram, shows a hooded man launching Molotovs at a recruitment center in Siberia. It suggests, it suggests the Kremlin's TV, TV propaganda, propaganda described by ex-Russian ex state TV, TV journalist Jana Aglakova as a brainwashing machine, is failing. Is failing. Blazes, Blazes at coal plants, plants munitions, munitions factories, factories, industrial buildings, buildings and research centers, centers have also broken out since the war began, began on, February on February 24th. Shocking, Shocking footage, footage circulating, circulating on social media, media showed the town's chemical plant engulfed in an enormous cloud of black smoke. While the Kremlin, While the Kremlin has, yet has yet to offer insight on cause, insight on cause analysts, analysts believe, they believe they are the work of Russian saboteurs. saboteurs. Ilya Ponomara, a former Russian, a former Duma, Russian Duma, Duma member and anti-Putin activist, wrote on Telegram, wrote on Telegram it's, happening it's happening everywhere, and that's why nobody, that's why can, nobody say can say that it's the work of Ukrainian intelligence or Ukrainian saboteurs. He added, he added, Ukrainians could carry out some acts of sabotage close to the border, but they are not doing this in Vladivostok, obviously, it was Russians who did this.